What's up? Thanks for tuning in. We got a Werebear Druid here. Swipe Druid. Wreaking havoc on level 80 monolith. Just at the end of the day, chilling. House is quieted down. Everyone's winding down their day, so Dad finally gets the stream and blasts some Werebear Druid. Okay, world's longest rampage coming up. Not bad. Probably the longest one of the night right there. I think I'm just gonna suck it up again and give this bossy boss a go. What am I doing? <laughs> Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Axe, come on, wake up. Oh, I got lucky there. How did I dodge that moonshot? Oh. that up at the last minute. I mean, I watched Asmongold play a little bit on what looks like a Void Knight, and I mean, he was making light of the fact that he is basically just walking through the monoliths, and <laughs> his character is destroying everything in his path, and he's on his phone just chilling back, hardly paying attention to the game, and the... Uh, monolith is is cleared. <laughs> so when I saw that, I was like, oh, I'm really not probably doing it right. But this is uh, like I said, I started with my class fantasy, and that's always the Werebear Druid. So love it or hate it. So I'm halfway exactly to 74 now, and that was a pretty big challenge. I'm not gonna lie for this Druid. Hello! You want to come in and say goodnight? Nobody's watching me, so it's fine. Huh? Oh my gosh, you can absolutely have more time. No. Yeah, but, uh, zero viewers. Yeah. That's okay. I'm just on the grind. Okay, bye. Yeah, you know, daughter's got a screen time request, daddy's got a reply. Can't be busy streaming here to zero viewers. She just roasted me for having zero viewers, by the way. She apologized to me. She already knows what's up with zero viewers. So I have actually found myself um, losing track of time doing these monoliths, like, it's been very engaging just trying to get to the next echo and plot my path to find rewards. Just get out of here. See? You, like, you can't go wrong with that. Quick loading screen, back to here, pick up your rewards. Everything you need is right here. 
transfer your materials to the, the forge. Um, incredible stash space. Let's go. Look at this rampage. Let's go, 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 go. That's a good one. I like these challenges. Stay in the circle. Just like stand your ground and don't run away. Don't accidentally rampage out. Let's get this last passive here. Boom, 10 out of 10. So I think next I spec in a little bit down here to the Beast Master, which again, I didn't even realize you could do until I consulted a build guide. Gotta remember, I'm a dad gamer. So I've, you know, I, I really need to rely on people who play these games for full-time living and theory craft and write up those build guides. I, I would love to be able to do that on my own and have like a 12 tab spreadsheet that calculates all of those things. I've, I've done that in my past with video games, but it's just not feasible right now. So this thing hit a wall from my little homebrew build and uh, it wasn't until respecking into the recommended build guide that I started blasting through these monoliths. What about this relic? We got a plus to swipe. We've got attunement. What else could we use there? Some resistance, I'd say, or a crit multiplier. Um, considering my resistances are, wow, down, I need some physical resistance. So physical resistance, we're going to go ahead and add that. And then with these glyphs of hope, we're just going to try to... Well, let's do the tier ones first. Okay. Tier 5 physical resist. Critical success. Sounds good. It's tough to make a call right now. Each one of the games excels in certain areas. Um, and, and this is a 1.0 version of Last Epoch, right? So um, things are looking good. I, I'm very curious to see what happens when I get to a hundred level a hundred that's by making my way through these final monoliths and getting to the last rune here and then what there is to do at level a hundred uh, so in order for me to really make a call that's where I have to get but thanks for asking thanks though you know way better boss encounters in this game so far than anything I've experienced in Diablo in all honesty yeah, well, four, that is. Oh, maybe I gotta kill these eyes. Makes sense. Less beams. Ooh, ouch! There we go. 
got the Orbis down. He dropped the Sanctum Key and a unique ring with legendary potential too. Holy shit. 1.8% of melee damage leached his health. Amazing. Increased leech rate. Movement speed, chance to apply doom on it, and void burn deterioration with doom. I think this might be one that everyone is looking for to turn into a legendary siphon of anguish. And it, it might be an auto drop from that boss, so it's nothing special, but hell, let's yeah. try that out. Let's just see with more corruption here, just how much more dangerous and rewarding it is. Nice start off with an exile mage. That'll be a good test. Okay. I'm, wow. Okay, I'm definitely losing health all of a sudden. But I'm also still killing everything. Um, these swords attack much faster than my one-handed axes. Okay, I got the mage down. Nice long rampage. Oh yeah, go, 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 go. Yes! Rampage for life. <sighs> oh, she was part of the campaign. Oh. Oh, what? I wasn't expecting that. Oh, okay. Hurting her though. Hurting her. Alright. There. The void is all that is left. Let the void take him. Void. Will not take me. Understanding that mechanic yet. Other than don't stand in it. Accept it. The void is all that is left. Okay. Final stretch here. Oh, a big hit. Big hit. Okay, and that is how to finish a monolith. Looks like we got some nice gear to get to, but one of the first things it rewards you with is a blessing. So things like 10% increased prefix shard drop rate, 12% increased relic shard drop rate, and 34% increased bow shard. I think I'll go with the relic one. So seem hard to come by. Later, Critic. Thanks for tuning in, bud. I'm going to uh, probably take a break or even just call it for the night anyways, man. So that's a monolith. Thanks for watching.